It's good to have you join us on The Breakfast. Now, after six decades of nationhood, it is a day of mixed feelings for Nigerians as President Muhammad Buhari addressed some issues bordering on the unity, economy and the current price of fuel. Plus TV Africa's Mary Chinda captures some of the important points in the President Muhammad Buhari's October 1st speech. And barely four days after the NLC threatened the nationwide protests in the fuel pump price and electricity tariff, President Muhammad Buhari has defended the current price of fuel, stating that a responsible government must face realities. The president said this during the country's 60th independence anniversary speech early this morning. Shab, which is an oil producing country, charges 362 naira per liter. B, Niger, also an oil producing country, charges one liter at 346 naira. C, Ghana. Another oil producing country, the petroleum pump price is 326 naira per liter. Further afield, Egypt charges 211 naira per liter. Saudi Arabia charges 168 naira per liter. It makes no sense for oil to be cheaper. In Nigeria. The president also acknowledges that there are wounds and distrust among citizens, which he says needs to be addressed. We need to begin a sincere process of national healing, and this anniversary presents a genuine opportunity to eliminate all and all to all perceptions that are always put to test in the lie they always are. For the president, credible and fair elections are parts of the hallmark of a healthy democratic order, which he says he is committed to. I'm a firm believer in transparent, free, fair and credible elections, as has been demonstrated during my period as a democratically elected president. The recent build-up and the eventual outcome of the state election should encourage Nigeria that it is my commitment to bequeath to this country processes and procedures that will guarantee that the people's votes count. And talking about Nigeria's harsh economic situation, the president says no past government has done as much as he has using scarce resources. Largely, many analysts call the speech high as inspiring, while some other analysts say it can only pass for a talk shop without clear practical steps to be taken. Mary Chinda reporting for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.